Another lesson from the playground. How to send someone home. How to kick someone out of your game. Um, listen, we, we, I played in a team setting for, especially a more competitive team setting, for almost 20 years of my life. That's what I knew. And the best teams were the ones who were able to handle the conflict and have the necessary conversations um, with each other, typically without the oversight of a coach, and sometimes heated conversations um, to win games and to have a better understanding of each other. Uh, one, I just think of Kindle School Playground when I was a kid. If any of our friends was being annoying or was interrupting the game, or maybe I was with a super intense tantrum because I wasn't winning, uh, there were times that we just said, go home, get out, you're not playing with us. And of course, right after we said, go out, we're not playing with you, we would say, we'll see you tomorrow, or we'll see you later, or you can play the next game. The relationship was still there, but the simple fact is we argued about something, and one of sometimes the solution was, go home. Uh, in today's environment, especially as a, as a college coach trying to get um, collegiate good players to own their own team and to have the tough conversations, this is often a foreign concept to today's players. And it's not their fault. It's not that they're not capable of it. It's just that they've never been able to get get the freedom to do so. Uh, when you play in a summer league, in a fall league, in a spring league, in a winter league, uh, in an organized environment, it's up to the coach to do those things, rightfully so. Um, and again, this doesn't mean that we should cancel all the leagues. I run them myself, but one of the reasons I run a lot of things differently or even sometimes coach my youth teams differently, is I'll step back and let them fill that void and, ha and encourage them to have those conversations because they don't have the playground. They don't have that opportunity. And it's essential to know that you can kick someone out or at least come close. Two minutes is up.